Shout out to the KJ fam and you rock with Kristen and Jamia. We're back, you guys, for another food review. Woo! But not just any review. What? Yeah, today we are trying Megan Thee Stallion's brand new hottie sauce from Popeyes. Yes. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Megan Thee Stallion got a deal with Popeyes. Yes, she did. And she has a new hot sauce that Popeyes is using. And we are really excited to try it. That's right. It's, uh, do you know the name of it? Hottie Sauce. Yep, Hottie Sauce by Megan The Stallion. Not The, The Stallion, which I just learned that. Swear. Well, it's T-H-E-E. It the is! Stallion. Megan The Stallion. <laughs> Shut up. I know, right? Mind blown. Okay. <laughs> For those of you who care. You guys might know her from her hit, Knees Like Megan. <laughs> Knees. Yeah, right. Knees like Megan. Knees like Megan. Knees like they're like it's not Knees. <laughs> it is Knees. Knees like Megan. Knees like Megan. <laughs> That's the proper way of saying it. <laughs> Cause she does have Knees. Knees exactly. Okay, for those who have no idea what I'm talking about, which is probably just a small percentage. Yeah. Basically, there's a song. Like, yeah, it's a song. It says Knees Popular. Like Megan. It's all over TikTok. You yeah. Know. Anyway, so what we did get, um, we got a few different things. Uh, let's start on this right side. So they actually offer the chicken sandwich itself with the sauce on it. So this one's mine. It's literally the sauce on it. Um, I got Kristen's without it just in case it's too spicy. I wasn't sure. Thank you, baby. Um, but we do have some extra sauces here. We have five to be exact of these yep. sauces. Let me see if I can get you guys to see that. I don't know if you can see it. Wait, Maybe I'll yeah, cover, cover my face, face too. Man. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Okay, let me do two. Let me cover both of our faces. Okay. Oh, there you go. There you go. Hey! I don't know how to fix that, but it's all good. I'll fix it. I'll fix okay. it at some point. Yeah. Um, so yeah. chicken sandwich. Obviously, we're gonna have the. He has the sauce on it, but he's gonna pour more. I'm gonna pour sauce on it. Exactly. We got some uh, chicken strips. Chicken nuggets right here. Sweet. We got that, and, and I was like, you know, let me just go to Chick Fil A because I really like their nuggets too. So I got some Chick Fil A nuggets to try this with also, and in the front we got some apple pies, of two course. of them. Because I really wanted apple pie. I don't know if Kristen did. No, it sounds good. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay, cool. I was going to say, I'll eat it if you don't want it. <laughs> okay, so we're going to really taste this for you today. We're going to yeah. rate it on heat on a 1 to 10, mm -hmm. flavor on a 1 to 10. We're going to do our best to describe this flavor for you, you guys. Yeah. So you have an idea of like what you're expecting when you roll up to Popeye's to try this. If exactly. You That's right. Okay. Okay, fam, so we're going to go ahead and dig in. We had to actually warm up the food just a little bit. I wanted to make it a little bit warmer, but let's go ahead and dig into this sauce. And I want to point out how Ooh. amazing my chicken sandwich looks compared to Jamil's. I know, what's going on with that? I mean, yours looks good. I mean, mine looks good, but not like yours. You got a pickle hanging from it. Oh, they gave me two pickles. That's cool. That's nice, but in the sauce, okay, they did a good amount with the sauce, yeah. so it I'm curious. Good. Okay, I'm excited. So am I just going to dip mine? I say you dip yours, and let's try it out. I'm going to dip mine, too, a little bit more, just so I get a little, a little more extra sauce. Drip, drip. <laughs> Got the drip, drip. I didn't want to taste it, because I want to taste it with the sandwich. Good idea. And then, okay. So it's pretty watery. Uh, I could smell it right away. It's definitely like a sweet and sour sauce, like you're saying. Kristen pointed out, too. It's like a, looks kind of like a sweet and sour clear sauce. And Kristen loves that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Man, okay, we're gonna see. Yes, it looks like a sweet and sour sauce, like from you know, like McDonald's, yeah. but waterier. Yeah, exactly. All right, here we Should go. I just pour this on. Yeah, that's what I did. Okay. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. You can do more. Do you want to do a little more? Well, I don't... <laughs> this is joking. Oh, okay. I'm like, no, I don't. Okay. All right, here we go, fam. Okay. One, One two, three. three. Okay. I like it. I like it. One more time. Mmm. I'll try it again. Mmm. This tastes just like they're... Was it sweet heat or? Sweet heat. It is exactly the same. Mm. Hold up. Let me try it by itself. <laughs> yeah, that's what actually, um, yeah. It tastes exactly the same to me. Because it has that cherry-ish flavor to it. Okay. 
It's exactly the same. Okay, so just so you know, that we're about to describe this for you. Yeah. Megan. <laughs> okay, so it's... The stallion. <laughs> hot sauce, aged red cayenne pepper, distilled vinegar, salt, water, sugar, corn syrup, honey, mm. food starch modified, contains less than 2% of spice, distilled vinegar, invert sugars, and natural flavors. Mm-hmm. So, how would you describe it? Sweet. Yeah, it is. It's a sweet hot sauce. Um, I would and sour. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. It's not that spicy either, which is good. I mean, it is spicy, but it's mm-hmm. nothing like you couldn't handle. So if you did want to try this and you're not a big spicy person, you'd be fine with this. I'd say out of 10, it's like a two, right? You saying a two? It's I was going to say, I would say a two, actually. It's funny you say that. Okay, so if you like sweet and sour, this is good. Mm-hmm. I don't love sweet and sour. However... I don't mind this. It has a cherry flavor like It's better like with the said. chicken. Mm. It's better with the chicken than it is with the sandwich. Mm. Definitely. Mm. Yeah, the chicken, I feel like by itself is perfect, but with the bread, the sauce doesn't go well with the bread, I think, in my opinion. Yeah. Mm. You know, Bronco sauce from Arby's. That's what it is. It's like the Bronco sauce. It's Bronco sauce. Yeah. That's what it is. It's, yeah. But with a little kick. It's similar to that. Mm-hmm. I'm going to be honest. There is definitely nothing special about this. No. Not at all. Like, I, I mean, I wish I had the sweet heat and or the Bronco sauce to kind of see what it tastes more like, but mm-hmm. it tastes very similar to those things. Yeah. To be honest, although I don't love hot, hot, Yeah. I'm disappointed it's not hot. I know. I, I guess know. it has a little kick. It does. <clears throat> I would say it's a two. I'm surprised you give it a two. It's a two. I would have thought you would have thought it was hotter than that. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. No. It gives like a hit, a, a kick, but... Mm-hmm. Then it's like, go, goes away. Try it with the um, Chick-fil-A nuggets and let me know what you think. I had one already. What do you think versus the two? I think it goes better with the, the Popeye's chicken nugget. Yep, I agree. Mm-hmm. It's, it's not that great with the Chick-fil-A sauce, or yeah. Chick-fil-A nugget. So, you don't like it okay. with the chicken sandwich? Um, yeah, it's not that great with the bread. Because the bread is sweet and it has its own, like, flavor to it, kind of clashes. Mm-hmm. It's not bad, it just doesn't, you know, it doesn't do anything special, I think. So, one to ten on heat, we agree it's a two. Mm-hmm. You're fine. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, you could probably handle this. Oh, no. Um, how about one to ten on flavor? As far as if it's a good flavor or not? Mm-hmm. It's mediocre. I, um, I would prefer to just have the regular sweet heat. Uh-huh, yeah, you like the sweet heat. Yeah, um, I like the sweet heat. I'd give this, um, I mean, it's not going to be much. It's like a five. It's okay. Yeah, I agree. Are you Man, a five? yeah, we have to stop right now. <laughs> no, it's true, though, because... It's like, you're like, oh, it's sweet. And then it goes away, like the sweetness. Yeah. And then you're like, oh, there's a kick. There's a little hot. And then that goes away. Mm -hmm. So to be honest, you're kind of underwhelmed by the sweet and the heat. Mm -hmm. Sweet heat actually is sweet and hot. Sure. I can see that. Like it's more extreme. This is like building up to the O and you don't quite get there. Exactly. Now, this is just a marketing thing that they do. You don't understand. (laughs) You don't understand what I meant, okay? (laughs) But you know what I mean? I think I've mentioned that when it comes to food. You're right. You're building up. You're like, ooh, it's getting there, you know? It goes away. I'm just wah, wah, yeah. Kind of like the hot chip I had the other day. Yeah, no. It never quite reached its peak. Oh, you got to the O. You (laughs) got there with the hot chip. That's for sure. No, but, um. Yeah, so, okay. Italian. So, I mean, do you think this is worth it? No. Would you tell the fam to go to Popeyes to try this? Heck no. I'd say I would. I'd be more inclined to say, don't go to Popeyes to try this, rather than yeah. You know what I mean? Because honestly, it wasn't mm-hmm. worth the drive. I have to say too, like Meg, you know, Megan got bank from this deal. Oh yeah. Bank. How much would you think she got from this? Probably. From just the sponsorship? Yeah. Probably 2475000 okay. 
three hundred sixty-two dollars and maybe some change. I'll say like sixty-two cents. Did you look it up? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't ask her to repeat the numbers either. I'm going to tell I'm you right now, she got way more than two mil. Mm-hmm. I was thinking like 20. Oh, really? Maybe, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I was thinking like at least 20 mil. I have no idea. You have to. Your name is on Hot Sauce, on Popeyes. Yeah. Had to get 20 mil for this. I don't know. And she's big. And, yeah. And, um, no. Okay? Mm-hmm. She's like, this is so good. You got to try it. <laughs> It's really not, it's very underwhelming. It's not yeah, bad. It's not bad at all. But I just wish that, like, look, if you're going to freaking do this, yeah. make it, like, memorable. Now, I do have to say something, because a lot of people do mention the comments when I'm like, oh, this is good. Then I'll be like, I'll rate it a one. <laughs> Honestly, with this thing, I don't mind it. It, it actually, it tastes, it, it's okay. It tastes decent. Um, obviously, the sandwiches are good from Popeye's. I like the chicken nuggets a lot, too, so it definitely makes it, you know, work. And the sauce is okay. It's okay. It's just not... In my opinion, it's not worth it yeah. at the end of the day. That's kind of what I'm trying to say is it's not worth going to get it. I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend it. No. I definitely wouldn't. The more I eat yeah. it, the more I don't like it. Oh, you don't like it? Okay. Mm-hmm. I right. see to me it's just the same. It's just whatever. I think the flavor gets old real quick. Mm. You know? Mm-hmm. Sometimes there's sauces like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. That's it's I okay. This. I got the black and ranch one just in case. That one's good. Mm-hmm. So yeah, don't come here. <laughs> I mean, if you come to Popeye's regularly for lunch, sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, try it out. If you, exactly. Uh-huh. If you're at Popeye's, mm-hmm. you want to try the sauce, try it. Yeah. But don't go out of the way for it. No. No. How but, about the apple pie? Have you tried it before? Oh, yeah. We can... Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm sure I have, but I don't know. But mm-hmm. I have to say, Megan, mm. power to you, though. <laughs> oh. Speaking of that, how much money she made... Mm-hmm. So you're thinking she made like 20 mil. So more than like... Because see, I don't know how it works when it comes to putting their name on something. I was thinking maybe she made like 2 mil because this is also a promotion for her. Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. But... But probably not, you don't think? You don't from think so? concerts, she makes that and more. But just from a concert. Yeah, you're probably right. She's probably killing it. I think she made like a lot. That'd be crazy. Look, oh, Popeyes, if you're out there, mm. you need to make a, a K&J meal, <laughs> okay? <laughs> K&J meal, and we'll make it exclusively. We'll hook it up. Mm-hmm. It won't be a standard sauce. It'll be something different. I, yeah, if we did, it would be a hella good flavor. What would you want to do if you did your own, like, if any of, okay, what fast food place would you want to do a meal for? Man. It's <laughs> a good question, right? Yeah, it is a good question. I don't know. Jack in a box? No. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, any, I don't know. Anyone's fine, you know? Anyone's okay. But I already know what I want my flavor profile to be. Well, would, well okay. Well, well, let's choose one first. McDonald's then? No. Okay. Okay. We'll say Carl's Jr. Mm-hmm. Carl's Jr. Okay. Carl's Jr. Okay. Um... Um, I would want like a ranch barbecue, mm-hmm. a little bit of like sriracha in there, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Is it a burger or is it a chicken uh, sandwich? Oh, that goes with it? It goes with yeah. a burger. So sriracha and ranch on a burger. No, and barbecue sauce. Yes. On a burger? Yes. Bomb. Man. I'm just saying the the idea. You're trying to put Carl's Jr. out of business. That would be. It would be like. It would be good. No one's doing this. Okay, what would your thing be? No, honestly, all all jokes aside, it, it actually doesn't sound bad. You know, it doesn't sound yeah. bad. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It depends on, of course, the barbecue sauce, because you know you want it to taste good. The barbecue sauce can make it or break it, essentially. Yeah, but you yes. know, of course. So you would just do. I'm a just burger. saying, like the flavor kind of profile. Would you do fries? Would you do any fries with it or anything? Yes. Oh, you would? Okay. Um, delicious burger. Just basic fries? No. <laughs> Something nice. Something with pizzazz. Mm. Fries with pizzazz. Maybe a seasoned fry of some kind. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But okay. this is us, though. No, I, well, no, it's not us. Okay. Because, <laughs> first of all, if it was us, I'm going to be like... No to the sriracha, <laughs> no to the barbecue sauce. <laughs> okay, what would you want? No, um... Oh, that's funny. 
I would probably want to do... This is not us. <laughs> I'd probably want to do a Burger King. Because mm-hmm. I like the base of the burgers. I would do Burger King. I would do... I would take like a Whopper, for example. It'd be extra cheese. Mm-hmm. It's got to be extra mm-hmm. cheese. And then... That's a, this is a good question, right? Because mm-hmm. I would do extra cheese... I think I'd also get. Don't they? Do they have like a secret sauce on there, or they just have mayo? Whoppers. Yeah. Yeah, they just have mayo, but they okay. have um, Burger King has a zesty sauce that's good. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I would just do. I would do a lot of mayo. Make sure it's a lot of mayo. Maybe not extra, but a good amount. Extra cheese, and then I'd probably put. <sighs> you know, it's funny. I I'm <laughs> I'm not a huge. Well, you know what I would do? It. I would put French fries on the burger. Oh, okay. Uh huh. French fries on the burger. And maybe extra tomatoes. Yeah. <laughs> no tomatoes. No tomatoes, by yeah, the way. Uh-huh. You're taking the tomatoes off. You don't even need the lettuce. Take the lettuce off, too. Uh-huh. Just leave onions on there. Mm-hmm. I'd put, yeah, just some fries. Okay, I didn't know we could go ketchup. crazy. But that's, what, that's yeah. Okay. It's a good idea, right? Yeah. So that's I, that's yeah. the that's J meal. Okay? That's the J way. That's going to be the J meal. Okay. You can do the K meal at a... Uh, and uh, Carl's Jr. <laughs> no, the K-meal's good. I'm not going to put the french fries on the burger, but I will mm. have a seasoned fry that's hella bomb. Mm. A really good burger, you mm. know, with everything. Like, I like everything on my burger. Mm-hmm. And then I'm going to have a d- delicious sauce. Again, a sauce that you're going to want to dip every bite into both the fries and the burger. Mm. What's a drink? So we're getting separate, basically separate, <laughs> separate situations. Exactly. What do K- I want to drink? Mm-hmm. A really good... <laughs> a really good water diet like Mountain Dew kind of like drink mm, okay. but I don't think Carl's Jr. has Pepsi they have Coke products oh that's okay though so we need to be it's a fantasy ooh like a mm-hmm. I love Coke Zeros with cherry mm. so maybe something like that Coke Zero. oh actually those are really good yeah I think that'd be good listen no we have to do this deal together uh, well listen We're I'm not saying it's one. A, okay I would do Carl's Jr. I would but once again no tomatoes on it. Yeah. No lettuce. I, I'd have to get extra cheese. Extra cheese. A extra good cheese amount of mayo. Sure. Yeah. Extra patty. Two patties. Yep. Extra cheese. Yeah, you would. Some onions on there. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and put some fries on top of that. Uh, I, I guess ketchup and ketchup and mayo is cool. I agree. Your oh, bur- your burger is gonna be good. Mustard. You don't like mustard. I love mustard. But on your burger? Yes. I get the cheeseburgers from A and W right there. Yeah, I think you. No, the A and W one. So you want mustard also? Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, maybe not. Okay, I think I. I'll take mustard on mine. Okay, let's no, take. Let me take the mustard. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I would do ketchup on it. Yeah, ketchup and really mayo. Good. I think that would be really good. Perfect. And then to drink, yeah. um, a root beer. Yeah. Because that's what I drink. Yeah. I always drink root beer. Yeah. You guys don't see it because I'm always drinking diet Pepsi for some reason, or Coke. Yeah, I'd want a cherry. But Coke root beer is my favorite. Yeah. Okay, your burger sounds bomb because you're going to have yes. double meat, double cheese. Exactly. I'm more of the sauce. Got it. Is what's going to be really good. Well, when Carl's Jr. calls, I'm going to be answering the phone, okay? <laughs> I'm going to tell them, yes, let's get this. I'm going to say, stay away from Kristen's question. <laughs> Kristen's order at all costs. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I'm teasing. Fam, tell, tell us if you think my meal tastes better or if Kristen's. I Sounds better. You think so? But I, you have, but it's because you didn't. We haven't created well, my concoction yet. <laughs> what do you mean? But we haven't created my sauce yet. But I, that's my mine's I all about the doing. sauce. No, you have to. I have to pick mm-hmm. the kind of barbecue sauce I want to mix with the kind of ranch, and then how much sriracha I want in my sauce. Like it's 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 like a mm. perfume. What you type know? of uh, barbecue sauce would you do? I definitely sweet, like a sweet baby raise. Oh, okay, okay. With a really good ranch, like. A ranch yeah. from like old Chicago pizza. Ah, uh, I see. What Mix you're that up. A okay. little bit of heat, not much. <laughs> okay. And then you're gonna wanna dip every bite into and the burger's gonna have a one patty, yeah. one piece of cheese, yep. but lettuce, tomato, <clears throat> onions. Yes. Um, it'll still you can have a base of, you know, a light thin base of mayo ketchup already. Okay. But we're gonna add the, you know, a packet of sauce. To it. Got it. That's Sweet pretty good. bomb. And like seasoned fries. Bomb. <gasps> cheese fries. Listen. I'll do cheese fries. This isn't fries. a custom fast food place. Cheese fries. <laughs> cheese fries. Okay. <laughs> Look, you're thinking about like going to like in and out Seasoned or... cheese fries. <laughs> so yes, mine would be very good. 
That sounds pretty good. But you know mine sounds better. Yours sounds really good. Mine sounds like Yeah, because like you legit. love to hook up your burgers with double meat, double cheese. Yes, and extra yeah. fries. Yeah, and fries I mean, and the ketchup right over no it. No tomato. Okay, no which tomato. one sounds better? Carl's Jr., if you're listening, no tomato. Okay. <laughs> you can put tomato on mine. Yeah. Okay, which sounds better? Would you have lettuce, onion? I'd have some onions on there. Uh-huh. Maybe maybe grilled. You really want them right now. Yes. It sounds good, doesn't I it? I want grilled onion. Oh, no, I like, raw. I like raw. I like raw, too. Grilled onion on mine. I have both. <laughs> That's good. And you can choose grilled <laughs> or raw choose. for mine. <laughs> Well, I can Listen, tell you this. If yeah. They would never come for us for one. <laughs> Let's start there. Never say never. Until we get to that Megan and Stallion. If we ever got to Megan and Stallion side us, then maybe. But on top knees of that thing. Knees like Kristen. Knees like Kristen. It's Knees. Knees <laughs> like Kristen. Knees like Kristen. And then even if we did, they did contact us, they'd be like, look, we're just giving you a sauce. Yeah. <laughs> It's like you're not BTS or anything. <laughs> we we'll give you a sauce. Give you a sauce. We'll, and, re- and really, what we're giving you is our already made sauce. We're yeah. just gonna change the name. Yeah. <laughs> Too much. Ahead. I'd be like, deal. <laughs> Sold. I'd be like, exactly. All that sandwich, the burger talk, out the window. I don't care what it looks like. Your burger? No, I br- I want you to create your own burger. I you should. Deserve it. Listen. You deserve it. I'm serious. Uh, thank you. I you appreciate it. You deserve burgers too. with no tomatoes. <laughs> I appreciate it. And you deserve it. double meat, double cheese. It sounds he good. He loves that. I do. Would it, would I it have do. pickles on it? Oh, of course it would have pickles. Oh. <laughs> so I forgot mine. the pickles. <laughs> of course. Good call. Good call. And just for a surprise, which they, would, they wouldn't tell you, they put the one chip on it too. <laughs> right underneath the burger the one chip so the first bite you'll know the pain I felt the pocky chip <laughs> exactly yeah I just... put a pocky chip right under under the burger but above the pa- the, the, the the bun so you don't know what so bite you don't it know is what's out. you don't know what bite it is and you bite it and now you'll feel my pain so tomorrow can get each and every one of you back <laughs> exactly okay alright well I hope you guys enjoyed it I don't know we didn't talk much about it but it was nothing to talk was, about yeah, nothing to talk about yeah, yeah just the sauce <laughs> All right, fam. Don't forget to. I was watching Jersey Shore yesterday. Oh, you know? Okay. Sorry, really quick. I was watching okay. Jersey, Talk the original guy. Jersey Shore. Okay. And uh, it was just so funny. They were like tur- yeah. Jersey Turnpiking. Just What's that? They were just like literally putting their hands down to their feet and just like shaking their butt. Oh, that's a dance. Yeah, the Jersey Turnpike. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that. it's their dance. Yeah. <laughs> this is actually, I want to say, because mm-hmm. this came out like before twerking was like super popular. It was like yeah. 2010. Okay. Twerking didn't become popular, I think, until like later. Well, twerking <coughs> has always been popular, but yeah, it didn't but, like, really get see. into the yeah. mainstream until later 2000s. Anyways, but it was just funny. Yeah. They literally just like put their hand in it and then just shake their booty. Yeah. Um. Oh, my point was... Uh, I was envisioning Kinney's like Kristen oh, and yeah. <laughs> uh, doing something like that, but just bending my knees a little bit more. <laughs> it's random. So so go watch the Jersey Piking. The, Chris, the Kristen Turnpike. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It was random. Okay, it was random, but I love the Jersey Shore original. I don't, actually, it's, it is a really, if you're okay with like just laughing at People arguing and fighting is actually pretty. It's good. actually really sad. <laughs> really quick, I mean, it is sad. You guys have probably seen it, and if you haven't, yeah. you're not going to start now. Yeah. But Ron and Sam literally fought, at, like their relationship is the definition of a toxic, unhealthy relationship. Yeah. Throughout all the seasons, like it's mind boggling yeah. how unhealthy that was. Yeah. Anyway, so I'm just going to throw that out there. Yeah. As a relationship coach, I was like. Mm. But meanwhile, it's good TV. Uh, yeah. <laughs> meanwhile, it was it was the biggest show <laughs> on MTV for the longest time ever, you know? Mm-hmm. Okay, guys. All right, fam. Don't, Don't forget, forget to, to like, comment, subscribe, share, share it as caring, let your friends family know what the K and J fam are doing. And until next time, we hope you have a wonderful day, evening, or night, whatever time it is out there. We will see you in our next video. Mm-hmm. Peace. Peace out, Trav.